द पार्टिकल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम द ओरिजिन एट टी इक्वल टू जीरो विथ वेलोसिटी ऑफ टेन पॉइंट जीरो जे कैप दिस वन इज एक्स एक्सिस एंड दिस वन इज वाई एक्सिस दिस वन इज द ओरिजिन एंड द पार्टिकल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम दिस जीरो कॉमा जीरो एंड द पार्टिकल स्टार्ट विथ वेलोसिटी ऑफ टेन जे कैप दैट मीन्स द इनिशियल वेलोसिटी ऑफ द पार्टिकल विल बी अलॉन्ग वाई एक्सिस द पार्टिकल इज मूविंग इन द एक्स वाई प्लेन the x component of the acceleration of the particle is 8 meter per second square and the y component of the acceleration of the particle is 2 meter per second square this one is for along the x axis this one is for the along y axis now the initial position of the particle along the x axis is 0 initial position along the y axis will be equal to 0 the initial velocity along the x axis will be equal to 0 and the initial velocity along the y axis equals to uh, 10 meter per second now the acceleration along the x axis will be equal to along the x axis the acceleration will be 8 meter per second square 8 meter per second square and acceleration along the y axis will be equal to 2 meter per second square now we have to find the time at which the x coordinate of the particle is 16 meter for this we can write down equation of kinematics x equal to x not plus u x t plus half a x t square we have to find the time at which the x coordinate will be 16 meter that means x will be equal to 16 x not will be 0 plus initial velocity along the x axis is also 0 and acceleration along the x axis is 8 from very basic calculation you can get the value of time t this time t and it will come out 2 second this is the time at which the particle will have the position of 16 meter along the x axis now the next part of the problem is that we have to find the y coordinate of the particle at that time that means at this moment 2 second we have to find the y coordinate for this we can write down y equal to y not plus u y t plus half a y into t square now to find the value of y coordinate in this equation the value of y not is 0 the value of u y is 10 meter per second hence y coordinate will be equal to 0 plus 10 into time will be 2 second plus half and the acceleration is 2 meter per second square and once again the time is 2 second you can get the value of y coordinate that will come out 20 plus 4 and hence it will come out 24 meter at t equal to 2 second now the next part of the problem is that we have to find the speed of the particle at this moment speed will be equal to root over vx square plus vy square now find the value of vx and vy at this moment that means at t equal to 2 second to find vx vx equal to ux plus ax into t ux is 0 and ax is 8 and 8 into 2 that's why it will come out 16 meter per second now find the value of vy and vy will be equal to once again ui plus ayt that means ui plus ay into t and ui equal to 10 plus ay is 2 and time is also 2 second after some basic calculation you can get the value of 14 meter per second put the value of vx and vy in the speed v of vx square plus vy square and then after that you can get the value of speed of the particle at t equal to 2 second 